Hello everyone, this is Super Comic Girl. So, I said in my previous video about digital versus uh, physical, and I hope I explained my position um, well enough. So, for people that do not know, um, I have a Kindle. I bought this a couple of months ago. Absolutely love it. I always take it to work with me. Um, so, I was... So I, I decided to find out if they had a particular issue on Amazon. And this is Action Comics issue number one. This is the first appearance of Superman. So the huge reason that I was looking for this issue was I will never own the first appearance of Superman. Never will own it. Sure enough, Amazon had it. I bought it for 99 cents. And this is his origin story. This is um, yeah. Action Comics, issue number one. I own it. Um, and have that. Here's some cover art. Um, It to where I can read it. And it's like, it's like, this is, uh, um, as a distant, uh, it's a distant planet was destroyed by old age. A scientific, scientist placed his infant son within the hastily de hastily device spacecraft launching it towards Earth. I don't know how he knew Earth was there, but okay. And then, yeah, it's just, it's, <laughs> it is, oh, um, it's just uh, how they talk back then. Um, yes, um, this is him with a woman over his head. Okay, this is definitely not Lois Lane. Um, I don't even know when Lois Lane appeared, but I will say I just got a kick out of this comic. Um, and so... Um, yeah, so... Uh, Yeah, so you have this bad guy with a gun, and of course Superman manages to uh, to to get through. Um, yeah, uh, the only thing that I really did not like. Um, oh yeah, here it is. So yeah, you can um, do that. Um, and yeah, it's just. Uh, it just turns into a comic book strip, which I thought was interesting. Um, but yeah, so I, I wanted to get this issue because I wanted to see what was so... Why is this Action Comics... Why was Superman's appearance like... I would say is... How does Superman... How did people respond to Superman when they first encountered him in Action Comics number one? And I'm pretty sure that if I was a little girl back in whatever year this came out, and I know somebody's going to say, it came out this year, um, I probably would have been just 
glued to my seat and and everything and what i really liked about at this action comics compared to um detective comics number one which is supposed to i believe is supposed to be the first appearance of batman the batman comic had other stories in it action comics just has one story this is this is superman this is superman saving the day without lois lane around um and you know you rough bat you discover he's a he's a, a reporter for the daily prophet it's not the daily prophet daily Planet. oh my i am not fixing that mistake you get it as is the daily planet Um, but he's a reporter, and I, I'm reading this, and I'm just blown away about how good this version, this Superman is great. He is, he's heroic, he's kind, he, you just get a story, you don't get other stuff with it, um, and I'm not going into the other stuff that we get in today's comics. But this is why I got Comicology. This is why I buy digital comics from Amazon. As much as I don't like what Amazon does, I really do appreciate that I can get a issue of a comic book that I will never ever own physically in a digital format and that is why I pay my comicology um bill every month. I this is you know this is what I enjoy. So I am going to give of course it's going to get five stars because it is the first appearance of Superman but I just enjoyed it a lot and um yeah so if you guys have a digital copy of Action Comics issue number one, what did you think about it? I mean, I mean, and also, did, was there Lois Lane in this one? Or did she come later? If anybody could tell me what issue does Lois Lane actually first appear, I would appreciate Because I want to get that issue and read about their first um, appearance uh, or first meeting. Uh, but, yeah, sorry about the uh, Daily Profit thing. I was like, oh. <laughs> But, yes, I, I loved it. It was, it was a great comic. And um, I'm going to continue to get um, them in digital, um, especially the much older ones that I can't get my hands on. Um, I definitely want to get the older Flash from, like, the Golden Age, like, from the Silver Age and all that. But yeah, so please uh, answer my question. When did Lois Lane appear in Superman? I would appreciate it. Or Action Comics. Um, so I'm going to be hunting down the digital version of the Hard to Find Comics. And I will be sitting down this summer, reading them, reviewing them. Um, oh, and something else is um, anytime I pay for a comic digitally... And it goes on thing, it automatically go. I, I, I'm going to have it put in my collection so I can sit back and I can just relax and enjoy reading a good book. So um, I'll see you guys around. Bye.